Hi, my name is Chell Lindgren. I'm a NASA astronaut, uh, and I served on the International Space Station for Expedition 44 and 45. So about 70% of first-time flyers will experience what's called space motion sickness, or spaced adaptation syndrome. And it uh, has some similarities to motion sickness back here on Earth. And, that we, and we think that that motion sickness occurs because of a difference between what our eyes are seeing and what our inner ear, our vestibular system, is sensing. And that disconnect tells the brain that something weird is going on and gives you that sense of uh, nausea or, or motion sickness. So when I got into space, initially I actually felt great. I was hungry, and my Russian colleagues were like, oh, you're doing great, no problem. Um, I was eating, and then after about four hours of being up there, I took a nap, and when I woke up, I was feeling pretty crummy. And for the next 48 hours, for the next two days, I didn't feel very well, I felt nauseated. Um, but after that, after kind of this adaptation period, I felt great, uh, and I was excited to get to work.